Prince Rami. Today, Adopt Me have released a brand new evil chick pet that's coming in to Adopt Me in Halloween 2021. Guys, this is so sick. So today, I'm going to be showing you the evil chick pet as well as the Halloween release date, guys. So let's go, let's get into this. But guys, before we do, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. But Starburst, I love your outfit today. What outfit is this? Presley, it's a wizard costume. I think it's pretty cool. I've got wizard shoes, a wizard badge, a wizard hat, and also a wizard book on my back. Oh, that kind of rhymed. <laughs> That's awesome, Starburst. And I kind of did notice the wizard book because, you know, I'm kind of sitting on it. So let's go. Let's start right and jump down to the main center so that we can see it even better. Let's go. Three, two, one. Oh, no. Oh, this isn't going to end well. What? <laughs> Guys, that was crazy. Okay, let's get straight into this. So recently on Adopt Me's, they said, Happy October. I'm going to use this space to post exclusive sneak peeks of our spooky Halloween update. Guys, with the eye emojis. You're going to want to keep an eye on these posts because our team are doing a fantastic job conjuring up all sorts of things for you this month. What could be inside this building? Any guesses? And guys, this is the image that Adopt Me linked with this photo, guys. And it's actually really, really awesome. Look at this. It's just a massive Halloween building, guys. It looks so, so awesome. So we can see that it's all barred up. We can zoom in real quick. It's all like boarded up, all the windows, so you can't get in. There's no way to get in. And this one, instead of the old ones being like orange and brown, this one is like red and black and purple, which I really like. It's like more nighttime themed and I think this is really, really awesome, guys. So there's lanterns everywhere held up by chains that are like put at the front of the building and stuff. And also there's new plants that just go around. We can also see little mushrooms that are around, guys. So maybe there could be a new mushroom potion. And then there's also a boarded up door that we might be able to unboard with like a crowbar and we've got to go around the map and find different bits of the crowbar bar to open up the building. That'll be so awesome, guys. And also, there's little paper and little pieces of messages around this building. So I wonder what they'll be about, guys. But let's take a look at Adopt Me's new pet that they've confirmed, the evil chick pet, guys. And here it is. I know you're probably thinking, Presley, that's a narwhal. <laughs> that's not an evil chick pet. But look behind the narwhal. Right here is the evil chick pet. So it's kind of hard to see since it's really dark. But guys, it stays on top of the stay out sign. And maybe if you go too close, the eyes, because they're like X's and glowing red, maybe the eyes will like shoot you with like lasers or something, guys. And it like shoots your feet. Oh my gosh, that'll be so crazy if it just shoots your feet if you go too close. Because in the 2020 Halloween update, we had the Frost Fury that did something very similar to that. We can go, we can grab our Frosty. What's up, Frosty? How you doing? Before the Frost Fury was added as a pet, it guarded the 2020 Winter Castle. And if you tried to go into the castle, the Frost Fury would like yeet you away with its tail. It would go like, what the? and then you would go flying, it was so sick. But guys, look at this. Maybe the chick will do the same thing, but for the Halloween update, guys. It looks so awesome. So it's sitting on top of the stay out sign, and it's lit, guys. Oh my gosh, I can't wait for this pet to actually come into the game as a pet that we'll be able to get, guys. It's also got like red crossed out eyes, which is like the main part of how I found it. But guys, it is so, so awesome. But this is the Halloween building where we'll be able to do one of two things. The first thing I thought is it could be a mini game, like a Halloween building maze. And you've got to find your way through the maze and there's like five different places where different prizes are. And if you find all the prizes and get out of the maze within five minutes, you can keep the prizes. But if you're stuck in the maze, you don't get any of the prizes, guys. That could be really awesome. And like there's five different mazes and every time you go in, it's a complete random chance of which maze it's going to be so that you don't memorize it and you don't cheat. That'll actually be pretty fun. Or you spawn at random places in the maze and you like have to go around because if you did the same maze over and over again, it would just not get too fun. So if it's just a massive maze, but you spawn in random places, then you don't know where you are and you like be completely lost. You've got to find your way to the center. Oh my gosh, that'll be so, so sick. And then you've got to go around and find all the prizes. Oh my gosh, I would love that so much. Or it could be a building where you can walk into it and exchange the brand new currency, which will be key 
candy corn and you can talk to somebody like B think and then go around and buy different pets. So you like go click and then you can like buy the pet. And I, I didn't even realize, look guys, it's a bunny. This is an actual bunny. Unlike the bunnies in our brand new Empire Family video. Uh, guys, go check it out. We did last leave the car and there were a ton of bunnies on the road. So many bunnies, guys. My mom, Beck, was just trying to dodge all the bunnies and it was super, super hard for her, you know? We kept on like going around the car and we were like, Whoa! because there were so many bunnies. It was just so, so weird. <laughs> Okay, people who have seen the video are gonna be like, Haha, I get his joke, but people who haven't seen the video, so most of you guys watching are gonna be like, okay, oh, I think you're a little bit crazy. I'm just gonna click off the video. <laughs> but guys, it's a joke that you'll understand when you watch the Empire Family video. So go watch that video after this one. But guys, this is not only Halloween leaks that Adopt Me have leaked today. They also leaked an epic image of the whole Halloween map. Guys, look at this. This is so lit. So this is the full Adopt Me Halloween map. So the whole map is going to turn orange, red, and yellow, like all the trees, and then there's gonna be little piles of leaves everywhere, guys. So that's what Adopt Me always does on fall. But guys, look in the background. That is the massive purple and brown area that the building will be in, guys. So we can kind of see the building in there. We can also see little ghosts. If you look there, I'm not sure if this is just coincidence or if it's actually real, but you can see a little ghost face like a little smiley face right there. And then that also looks like a black ghost right there to me. But guys, I'm really not sure, but I think I do see some tiny little ghosts just hidden around. And guys, I think that looks really awesome. Or it could just be leaves that look like ghosts. <laughs> But guys, this is what the whole map is going to look like. But with this, they also said the leaves are starting to fall with a little maple leaf. Fall map change and Halloween countdown will be out next Thursday, guys. So that gives us the release date of the Halloween update. Let's go. Let's head to calendar and let me show you the release date. So on the 14th is when the countdown and the map change is going to happen. And then Adopt Me likes to keep their countdown short and they go for about a week to two weeks. So Adopt Me is confirming that they're not releasing the update on the 14th, but they're going to be releasing it on the 21st, guys. 21st is the Halloween update, guys. Oh, whoops, I added a Q in there. It's a Halloween update. <laughs> but guys, that's a Halloween update and it could come on the 21st, which I'm 99% sure, which is less likely likely but could still happen guys but that is so so sick Adopt Me is adding their Halloween update then that's gonna be so lit and guys when this update comes into the game on the 14th they're going to be releasing a countdown and the countdown looks like this so this is the Halloween countdown that they use most of the time and here we've got a bat dragon and a shadow dragon because those were two of the pets that came in in 2019 and Adopt Me didn't use this in 2020 because they didn't even have a countdown but guys they're going to be using this in 2020 21 guys. So guys, the Halloween event in 160 hours, a little bit specific. <laughs> but guys, on that day, that's when they're going to leak two of the pets because they're going to need two Halloween new pets to actually hold the banner up. So they're going to be up there. And then the Adopt Me Nursery is going to be rethemed with pumpkins and different vehicles and stuff, guys. It's going to be so, so sick. So guys, this one went for 160 hours. So let me quickly Google that. 160 hours, two days. Come on, how many days is that? Oh, so that's six days. So guys, that is just even more proof that Adopt Me is going to be releasing it on the 21st. But also in 2019, they added two new tasks. So both of them were limited time tasks. They were the haunted house task, which replaced the school and the graveyard task, guys. The haunted house replaced the school. So whenever you needed to go to school, it was instead the haunted house task. And then instead of going to the playground, you went to the graveyard, guys. So guys, this will be so awesome to actually have in the game for two brand new tasks. And the Halloween 2019 update is the best Halloween update. That's what everybody says. I did like the 2021, but I think the 2019 one it did look even more awesome. But guys, I think because they're starting it much, much earlier than before, like last year they were doing like weekly updates and they were kind of rushing themselves for the Halloween update. But I think because they've given themselves a full month to work on this and they've got like 40 people to work 
work on it. It's gonna look so, so awesome having them all there. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see all the brand new pets and all the brand new items. But guys, let's go. Let me show you some awesome concepts for some more brand new pets that could come with the brand new evil chick pet that's been confirmed. So guys, we're in a game called Halloween Custom Pets. And in this game, you can literally get custom Adopt Me Pets. So look at all these pets, guys. They're so, so sick. And I actually went through in another video and bought every single one of them. So let me show them all to you. To start off with, we have the most rare one. And this is the Golden Horned Dragon, guys. This is literally just a dragon with gold horn horns, guys. And it's also been recolored. But this looks so awesome, guys. It's the Gold Horned Dragon. And throughout the map, there's different things that could come with the update, including brand new balloons and little ghosts that just sit around the map that are so cute. Oh my gosh, I love them. But guys, on the hotel, there's a massive tarantula as well as ghosts haunting it. I think this is so cool. But guys, let's pull out another Halloween pet. And this one is the rarest one, the pumpkin dragon. And this is a bat dragon that's been recolored with a pumpkin on its head. And I think that's so, so awesome, guys. So these are the two most legendary ones. Next up, though, we have the ghost cat, guys. And look at this. This is so creepy. And it's also stuck in the floor. Okay, let's let that load and glitch for a little bit. Okay, but guys, this is the ghost cat. And this is like white and pink and stuff. I think that's so cool. And also, um, you know, when you ride it, your head is kind of inside of it. Meaning now it has a head slime and also some little tufts of blonde hair. <laughs> But guys, let's go. Next up, the pet that they've made is a Bobo, which is kind of cool. Like, I love how it walks. It just walks so happily. Like, do 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 da da ba boop. <laughs> guys, that's so cool. But guys, next up, we have the ghost cow. No, not a ghost cow. A zombie cow, guys. This is so, so sick. It's like a, literally just a cow, except wherever it's black, it's green, and it's also got spines on its back, which is so cool. Okay, next up though, guys, we have an evil fox, which is like a kitten, but only with one tail, and it looks more like a fox. But I really want to me to add a normal fox pet to start with, because even though the evil foxes do look awesome, I would just love a normal fox in the game, like a red fox. But guys, let's go. We've got four more of these pets. There's the evil butterfly, which looks so, so awesome, guys. So evil. We also have the zombie rat, which is like an orange and green rat, which is kind of gross and super creepy. <laughs> oh, this person's like UYT. I just said, yep. Smiley face. <laughs> okay, guys, let's go. We've got another one, the Reaper's Bird, which looks a bit like the Robin. And I would like this as just a normal pet. That'll be so cool. But guys, we also have one of my favorite pets. It's the cute little pumpkin bear. Look at this. We can ride it. And it is so, so cute. Just hops around. Boing, boing. Oh my gosh, I love that so much. But guys, if you're excited for Adopt Halloween update, let me know down in the comments below. I'm going to go riding on my pumpkin pet, and I'll see you in the next one, guys. Have the best day ever. Peace! Yeah.